All right, then the other thing, when it comes to bread, mm -hmm. um, you shouldn't really grab bread without offering it to somebody else first. So you should say that really surprised somebody over would there. Would you care for some bread? Yeah, yeah. And God forbid someone asks you for the bread, we don't do this. No, you don't do that. <laughs> no. Although I'll take that from you. All right, so here's the thing about eating bread at a restaurant. So you put your bread on your bread plate. Then a lot of people don't know what to do once it's there. You take the butter from the center of the plate and put some butter on your bread plate. That is not your butter knife. Do you oh, see? Yeah. Right. You the don't take the butter from there and slap it on your roll. You put it on the plate. You put the butter on the plate. And then, oh, that was a biggie. Yeah. And you and you don't butter the whole roll at once. You take you butter a, a, piece a piece of the roll. Of the roll, one with mouthful. With your own knife. With your own knife, put it on the bread, and then you pop it in your mouth. Like that. Yes, that's really. That's what you do in a nice restaurant. And everything in a restaurant works in this direction. Clockwise. Yes. So the first thing you would do is maybe take a bite of bread and you're going to need a beverage to wash it down. It all kind of makes sense and you go from outside in, correct? Outside in, exactly. And outside yeah. in for your silver. Because the world has gotten so casual, mm -hmm. yes. we've all forgotten our table manners. A lot of us eat, watching the TV, that kind of thing. But when you go out to a nice restaurant, sometimes you feel a little bit lost. I'm going to give you some absolute basics for when you sit down at a, at a nice restaurant and eat. First thing you do when you get to the table, napkin goes in your lap, the first, first thing, okay? Boom, on the lap, bingo. When you go to a super fancy restaurant, they take the napkin and put it in your lap. <laughs> the yep. first time I went to a super fancy restaurant, I was with my mom, I was 17, and the man uh, took the napkin away and I ripped it out of his hand. <laughs> <laughs> That's mine. <laughs> Give me my napkin. Yeah, it's always weird when they put it in your lap. Like, <laughs> You're like, oh. Okay, keep your hands where I can see them. Uh, <laughs> okay, so a lot of times people don't know where your water glass is, where your bread plate is. Your bread plate is to the left of your forks. Your water glass is the one that's over your knife, and your wine glass is the one that's over your spoon, okay? Um, on the topic of wine glass, while we're talking about that, you should be holding your wine glass from the stem. From the stem so you don't change the temperature of the wine. Yes. And so you don't make a mess of the glass, quite frankly. Yes, exactly. Yes. Right. You hold it here, and then all of a sudden you got fingerprints all over it, and it gets all greasy. The other thing people don't um, remember so much is the salt and pepper rule. Uh, when, if Rachel were to ask for the salt, for example. Could you pass the salt? I would love to, Rachel. You pass both the salt, both the and, salt and the, the pepper. pepper. Uh, they stay they together. They stay together. They're a couple. They are. They don't like to be separated. Okay.